guys welcome back to my channel I'm on my way into Hobby Lobby today I'm going to be working in my classroom I have been doing a lot of commentary videos lately but of course I'm a teacher so my main focus is getting my classroom together um, today I want to show you a little bit about what I have accomplished so far and what I still have left to do if you're interested in that sort of material stay tuned Hey guys, I just love the saying about being humble and being grateful because your talent is God-given and fame is man-given. So I just love that. I told you guys I was at Michael's. I just wanted to stop in and show you what I saw. Hey guys, so I made it back from Hobby Lobby. I just wanted to show you guys what I end up getting. So let me show you a few little sales that I got. All right, so I went in and of course everyone needs a happy planner. I'm kind of disappointed because I already had one from last year, but they did not just have the dates and the inserts. You have to actually buy the whole calendar again to get what's inside. So um, I used my 40% off coupon. So instead of it being $32, it was actually $20. Then um, for my aromatherapy, I have the calm. So whenever they're in the classroom, you can put the calm on. Say hi. <laughs> okay as i was saying so um i have t uh my tables or group i have five groups so each one of these colors represent my group so whenever they're doing like any group work then i will be clipping them based upon if they're on task if someone is um, causing a disturbance if their noise volume or anything like that is um, too high i will be using the clip chart to clip down a group so that they can see while I am in small groups, I thought this was so great. It say, in this classroom, we help others learn, work hard, work together, try our best, and ask questions. The biggest thing for this year, I want them to ask a lot of questions because I'm doing inquiry base, and it was I don't know, like seven ninety nine or something like that. So that was a good deal. Plus, um, it was forty percent off because it's woodwork. Um, as well as these, I'm going to put enter and exit on them as far as my doors because I have a door that they will enter from and then I will, do have a door that they will exit out of. So I will be putting enter and exit on those. Then the first day of school, I will be taking them a picture with this right here and I will fill it out based upon the student and go and take a picture with them at the beginning so I can post that and also send that to parents on my remind. And also this great, great welcome, welcome, well it's like a door decor, but uh, if you guys can see it, it say welcome to class. We can be kind, we can be helpers, we can be given, we can be creative, we can be inventors, we can be dreamers, we can be writers, we can be friends, and we can be scholars. Together we can be anything. So of course I had to put that up. And it was just $6.99. Excuse my nails. So my whole hashtag for fifth grade is kindness and fit. So that's why I'm kind of gearing um, any type of motivational thing towards the act of being kind. Um, I did change out my board, so that would be my science board, but I am changing the uh, border. Like, it's kind of has the galaxy thing, but I don't like that it's pink. Um, and over here, I have social studies, but I'm changing this little, little circle here to a big one. I went to Walmart and purchased that, so I will have my zero, volume zero, which means turn your voices off. Um, so um, social studies will stay the same with the globe, so I will be putting, like, the any type of, like, for science, the phenomenon charts, and over here, any type of charting or um, what type of skills that we're working on. I will be putting that up on the board. Um, my main thing that I wanted to do today is work on my vocabulary, uh, my vocabulary board. I decided to make it an interactive vocabulary wall for science and social studies. So I will be working on that today. What I have for vocabulary was this science word works chart here that I'm about to get rid of. And you just put the word here. 
and its definition, but I actually want to do interactive to where we will put examples of that and maybe a picture or maybe a physical item. So I needed more space to do that with more words. So that's why I have decided to go against what I was doing as far as science. And I had one also for social studies. So I'm going to get to work uh, and I'll show you the end. All right, guys, I'm coming back just to show you my failed attempt at what I was doing. Um, I decided what I wanted to do, but now all my boxes have to be um, redone. So because I teach science, the way that I was going to do it is I'm going to use the word, say the word, for instance, is magnetism. And they're going to help me come up with a quick little definition for what what is a magnet and a non-example of what 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 is not a magnet and then they're going to give me an example and we're going to try to find something that is um, visually representing an example of it in a non-example and then at the bottom i'm going to have sentence stems and claims for them to put i claim that such and such is an example of magnetism because it sticks to things made of iron my valid my claim is valid because blah, 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 blah. So that's what I'm trying to accomplish. But now my boxes are off because I just started going straight across the board. And that's not where I'm going with it. Once I use the word at the top here, I will have for each lesson or each unit the words that we have used. But I do want to have some sort of visual for them to have that writing piece for, you know, that culminated or any assessment that they may have. So I love what I came up with. However, I have to redo it. So that was a failed attempt. Um, let me also show you what I did with the door outside. Um, and then I'll be headed out. So I put up the sign that says, welcome to class. And we can be kind, helpers, that whole little thing. And I love it so far. I think it's going to be good. This is my entrance door when the kids enter into the classroom. So I'm glad that that's lined up like that. Uh, this right here is my actual new uh, board. And I have each kid astronauts and they're holding up different flags to go with the theme. And I just started this. This is my welcome board here, and I will have a little plaque that goes right here that I'm working on. So I have a lot of things happening right now, but I do not have AC. So, uh, yeah, I'm just kind of working slowly but surely. Um, so, yeah, this is what I have so far. It's a hot mess still, so bear with me. I'll let you guys see the finished product at a later time. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, just finishing off my video for my classroom. I still have so many things to do. And um, I like the progress that I'm making. Uh, school start in about two weeks. So um, I'm not too far from where I want to be. I just have a lot of print work to do. And um, But as far as decorations, I'm not going to get all crazy with it. Because um, my classroom already kind of coming off too busy for me. So um, I'm kind of, in my mind, I'm going to scale back on some things. But some things I will add, but some things I'm going to take away. So um, I will show you guys a little bit more as I go back into my classroom. Um, I hope you like the content so far. Um, I have many videos. Like I said, I'll be doing commentary on issues that kids are facing. And anything that's happening in the classroom, just my content will be kind of student-driven. Also, I will be doing like a teacher clothing haul like based upon like what i would wear and what's comfortable for me but also still um really really cute and complimentary to my shape my body so i will be having a few things that um that come out when it comes to how how to dress and um any pointers that i may have so hopefully you guys are interested please like comment and share this video um, I am trying to get to my first 20 subscribers and right now I'm like at 12 so I know I'm putting a lot of content out but I really really hope that you guys are enjoying my videos. Um, 
leave any suggestions on what I can do. Of course, I'm brand new to this whole process. I started on June 15th. So right now I'm just at bare minimum when it comes to what I will want my channel to become. But um, just getting things started on the ground level. I just thank you guys for your support so far. And if you watched the video this far, you gotta subscribe, okay? Have a good day. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.